The Saba government has ordered all state GLCs to purchase vaccines, according to state COVID-19 spokesman Masidi Manjin. Masidi, who is also the local government and housing minister, said the state cabinet had learned from reliable sources that the production of Pfizer vaccines will be disrupted and will impact countries including Malaysia that are using the supply. Masidi pointed out, however, that Sabah Health Director Dr. Rose Nani Medin had informed the state cabinet that the vaccine supply being sent to the state is so far adequate. Based on the state health department's planning and notification from the National COVID-19 Immunization Task Force, he said Sabah is scheduled to receive a further 1.5 million doses this month. He added that the supply had started to trickle in since last week. The victim then tried to contact the suspect but was unsuccessful. Meanwhile, he urged private firms, particularly large plantation companies, to buy their own vaccine supplies to inoculate their workers instead of waiting for free supplies from the government. Masidi said the state's strategic investment arm, Kazana Sabah SDN BHD, has been appointed by Pharma Niaga BHD to be the sole representative to sell Sinovac vaccines in the state. He said Pharma Niaga has a facility to store the vaccines in the state capital and advised companies that intended to buy its vaccines to reach out to the Kazana Sabah office here. Masidi said the state government is satisfied with the daily vaccination rate so far, adding that as of August 9, 42% of the population have received their first dose while 18.4% have received both doses. Dr. Sharul says air purifiers with true HEPA filters can help clean air. But he adds, I wouldn't simply trust any air purifier brand, they must use a good, proven filter. Meanwhile, in his daily COVID-19 statement, Masidi said the state government had today decided to allow walk-in vaccinations for all eligible citizens and non-citizens. This will be available at the various vaccination centres in the state. New infections hit a new record high in Sabah today after 1,514 cases were reported in the last 24 hours, which is 131 more cases compared with yesterday. <music> 